G'day, Alex from Lumsden Agency. Just continuing our series of interviews with the team. I'm um, sitting here with Jack, our videographer. Jack, thank you for being here. How does it feel to be on this side of the camera for once? <laughs> There's a reason why I'm on the other side usually. <laughs> no, it's good, it's good to be here. Thanks for having me. Video is such a big thing in, in the industry right now. We often have the conversation that there's not many people doing it properly or doing it right. Um, tell me why it's so valuable to our industry right now. I think, I think really good quality video can make or break uh, a campaign. Sometimes you send me some pretty shocking examples of stuff you found on the net and, and what's going around at the moment. And I think, I guess it adds to the existing copywriting and photography and it sort of rounds out the property for a client. It helps them put themselves in that property, like it's a much more sort of much more engaging, engaging way for buyers medium. to see. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Yeah. Like they and can, relatable. You know, we're showing people yeah. what their life looks like once they've bought the property. Is what we keep saying. Yeah, hundred percent. And I think we try and do it in, in a different way, in a different way as well. Like I remember when we first, um, when I first met you and we started working together, you, we, we were sort of like talking about what we we're going to do and. And I was expecting to do a kind of cookie cutter kind of like real estate video, or like wide pans of the room, this is that. And, the, and you kind of said, oh, look, it's not so much about the property. We're not really doing the property. And I was like, what are you, like, what are you talking about? Yeah, we're selling the lifestyle. Yeah, like, am, I, yeah. am I the right job here? Yeah. <laughs> is this the real estate job that I, yeah? But no, like, and I think it's, it's been really refreshing to kind of look at it with a different lens and, excuse the pun. <laughs> um, and, and yeah, try and, we, we, we try and do things a little bit differently. We try and think outside the box. Um, you know, we, we did like a, what it was like a, a tour of Camperdown, Camperdown a little while yeah, ago. Yeah, that was one of my favorite ones which so was, far. Which was yeah. like a really kind of cool, fun thing for me to shoot as well. Like it challenged me creatively. And I think we just did a little tour around the suburb and showed people some of your favorite things. So that was really cool. Yeah, that was cool. That was a lot of fun. Um, talk to me a little bit about what goes on in your head. One thing that I'm quite conscious of is, you know, the amount of, 2 a.m. text messages of I've got this idea and, and this is what we're going to do. Um, tell me what goes on in your head to make that happen then. Sure, sure. Um, we shoot a lot of ideas around and often, uh, yeah, I'll get like a random call or a text like, hey, I've got this like sick idea. I, I try and like see the potential in, in what we're doing and, and the plausibility of it and also try and link it right back to the story and who we're talking to, what we're trying to say. So. That leads me to my next question, which is when we walk into a client's home together, the, the team, um, what sort of things are you looking for specifically to capture that, that lifestyle and I guess help buyers relate to the property and, and the family or the people that live in it? We're always trying to imagine ourselves in that property. You know, I, I recently just, just bought a property with a partner as well and, and th those are the questions that we were asking. You know, we, we obviously had a a checklist of, of must-haves and kind of maybes and would be nice but really like we, we were looking at the area you know and we were looking at kind of how we'd see ourselves there in, in five years you know and, and you know walking up to the restaurants or like how close is it to the public, to public transport you know um, and I think being able to sort of tell that through video and through an engaging medium like, like video um, is, is really helpful for people to imagine themselves in that place. Really good in, engaging video is, is the key. Uh, from a videographer, from a cameraman's perspective, what are some of the things that you do a little bit differently? I think, um, I, think I, I like to bring technology into the mix. Um, we, yeah, we use the stabilize uh, gimbal whenever we can. We do like to do sort of like nice tracking shots. We give it sort of like a cinematic kind of feel. Um, I bust out the drone whenever it's legal, <laughs> whenever we can get it up. Uh, the drone always adds a bit of production value um, to a video. So I think, yeah, like mi mixing in technology, but also like an eye for composition and, and good shots, I think is, is key to sort of like good quality content. Yeah, one of the things that always amazes me is when we go out somewhere and I stand somewhere ready and you're always like, no, no, we have to stand over here because yeah. the light's better and this is coming from here. and it's, Everything looks exactly the same to me, but somehow, you know, you guys see it differently and, and it's amazing. That's you why guys I'm are really good at what you do. <laughs> exactly, that's right, you know, that's why we're here. You mentioned your partner and your place. Tell me a little bit about your family and specifically Billy is what I'm interested in. Billy, Billy's our, our, the latest addition to our family. Um, she enjoys tearing up toilet paper, uh, and uh, beef, beef schmackos are a favourite. 
Um, she's a six-month-old Italian greyhound, if you hadn't guessed. <laughs> uh, and she, she's the, the love and the bane of our lives at the moment. Um, yeah, she's awesome though. She's been keeping us kind of sane in this whole COVID situation. I'll bet, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah that's fantastic. Yeah. Thanks for being here today. I am super excited about a lot of stuff we've got coming up. Um, the ideas that are up on the mood board right now and in the text messages are going to be really fantastic. I'm really looking forward to it. So thanks for chatting with us. Awesome, thanks for having me. I'm looking forward to getting on the other side of the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers.